In this tutorial, you will learn how to troubleshoot and share your wireless internet in Windows 8. Sometimes, for whatever reasons, you can experience problems with your wireless connection, but there are some simple ways to troubleshoot. A good method is to reboot your computer as a first choice, as rebooting fixes problems that may relate to your Wi-Fi connection. You should check your network connection as well to see if the Wi-Fi connection is disabled. To do this, go to the charm bar, pressing Windows plus C keys. Choose Search and type Network Connection. Click on View Network Connections. A window will open. Here we can see that the Ethernet connection is enabled, but that the Wi-Fi connection is turned off. To turn it on, right-click on it and choose Enable. You'll see the option is available now. Double-click on it and you can choose to connect to it. Microsoft includes a Wi-Fi troubleshooting wizard with Windows. It will automatically fix any problem it detects. To run it, open the Desktop Control Panel by pressing Windows key plus X and selecting Control Panel. Click View Network Status and Tasks under Network and Internet, and then click the Troubleshoot Problems link. If you're using a laptop, be sure to check for any Wi-Fi switches. If you can't receive a Wi-Fi signal with any device, you may also want to try rebooting your wireless router. You can turn your Windows PC into a wireless hotspot, allowing other Wi-Fi-enabled devices to connect to it. It requires using a hidden command called a virtual hotspot. First, you'll need to create the Wi-Fi hotspot on your computer. Press Windows key plus X to open the Power User menu, and then click Command Prompt Admin. Type the following command in the Command Prompt window, replacing the network name and password text with your own name and password for the Wi-Fi hotspot. Now, you'll just need to run the following command to enable your Wi-Fi hotspot. Next, you'll need to enable Internet Connection Sharing. To do this, open the Control Panel, click View Network Status and Tasks, and click Change Adapter Settings in the sidebar. Right-click the adapter that represents your Internet connection, select Properties, click the Share tab, and enable the Allow Other Network Users feature to continue through this computer's Internet Connection checkbox. That's it! Use the following command if you want to turn off your hotspot in the future. Congratulations! You've just learned how to troubleshoot and share your wireless Internet in Windows 8.